Raoul, I'm leaving. Jaster. Yeah? I'm just thinking here, but... Dorgan Goa said he used the key, but nothing happened. You think maybe that's because you weren't around when he tried? What? What do you mean? Well, the thing is, you've got some kind of secret deep within you. Before you hit the desert, give the ruins one more try. It just might work if you're the one doing it. Wait. Desert Claw. You need to head for Kujay Desert. Why? I'm afraid I've tampered with the gate to the ruin. The key you have won't do a thing. But why? Why would you get in our way? If you open the path now, only destruction awaits. I can't let you go to Eden just yet. You've awoken the power of the Star King, Jaster. But not entirely. The power of the Star King? Yes, the power you used when fighting Seed. You held the potential to unlock that vast power within you. And that's why I gave you the Desert Seeker the first time we met. So... From the very beginning, you've been... Right. I had to guide you on your way so that you could unleash your true power. That's why I've been traveling through the galaxy. All to save our universe from destruction. Destruction? Right now, you should go to the place Raoul specified. Go there, and everything will become clear. But what's there? The truth. You'll learn everything once you get there. That's where our journey began. Yours and mine. Huh? Farewell. Hey, wait! What is all this? I, I still don't understand. Everyone just loves secrets, don't they? If we want to find out the truth, we'll just have to go there. Come on, Jaster. Raoul... What is it? What are you trying to tell me? What could possibly be in the middle of this desert? That will guide your way. Go now, Chester. The truth. You'll learn everything once you get there. That's where our journey began. Yours and mine. Raoul. What am I supposed to be looking for out here? No! Dad! 
It's a pity, Dr. Picaccio. Someone as highly regarded as you doing something like this. You know that duplicating memories is strictly forbidden. Yet you've kept your son Mark's memories hidden inside Steve, a robot you've created specifically for this purpose. You are hereby under arrest, in violation of Article Number 3241 of the Galactic Federation Law. We'll search the control room and confiscate any and all evidence related to Steve. Wait! Please, wait! Don't you understand, Dr. Picaccio? That's not your son in there. It's nothing more than a collection of data, with the same memory information as your son before he passed away. Doctor, everyone must die one day. Even those who we love very, very much are no exception. It really is a pity, Dr. Picaccio, having to send a great man like you to prison. We need to secure the evidence related to this crime. We're looking for a multi-purpose humanoid robot named Steve. Hurry! Sir! No! Leave Steve alone! I beg you! Oh my! This is terrible! What should we do? Dad... Listen, Steve. There's something only you can do. Only me? Yeah. You're the only one who can delete me. What are you saying? Hurry! You have to delete me! Otherwise, they'll get Dad! Absolutely not. I could never do that. The Doctor would be completely devastated without you. I... I'm not human. I'm... I'm just memories. Mark's memories. Nothing but... Nothing but data. Uh... Uh... We're not going to make it! Delete me, Steve! I can't! Dad and I have to part ways, Steve. Or he'll never stand on his own two feet again! Please, Steve! Help him! Help my father! Huh? Mark! What are you doing? Goodbye, Steve. Mark! Ah, uh, no! Mark! Mark! Oh dear, what happened? Mark! Mark! Oh no, this isn't happening. Mark! I'm sorry, Dad. Thanks for all that you have done. Do we just leave him like that? It doesn't matter. We can't arrest him without evidence. That's enough for today. I'd say we've done our jobs. Haven't we? Mark... Mark... Is it true? Are you really gone? Mark... And you cared so much for Dr. Picaccio? Doctor... What makes a human, human? Suddenly, I'm not so sure anymore.
enjoy today.